What's going on, all you chowderheads? Good morning. Morning. It's our cruise day, and it's finally here. We're going on the Disney Fantasy for a very merry time Caribbean cruise with three stops one in Cozumel, one in Georgetown, right? Mm -hmm. And Disney's Castaway Key. It's my first cruise ever. I've never been on a cruise before. You'll never go back. It's my first Disney cruise, but not my first cruise. Um, they just came and took our luggage. What is it? Like 7 o'clock in the morning? 7.06. 7.06. So the next thing we have to do is just go get breakfast. And we have to go meet someone at 9 a.m. down in the lobby here at Pop Century. And then I guess we'll go on the bus, Disney Cruise Line bus at 9.30. Yeah. So, awesome way to end this Disney vacation. We spent six days straight at the parks with our family, and now we're going to spend six days on the cruise. Yeah, I think we did it the right way of doing the parks first and then the cruise, because my feet are killing me, and I can't imagine going to work tomorrow like this. So. Yeah, we need a nice week to chill out. So that's that. We're gonna collect ourselves because we've been used to waking up at 9 a.m. <laughs> every day. And yeah, uh, 615 hurt a little bit this morning. Probably enjoy my last Mickey shaped waffles over here at the resort. I'll get a breakfast sandwich. And then go on our Disney's Very Merry Time cruise. Pro tip if you're staying at Pop Century. Don't come to breakfast at 8 a.m. because everybody's down here. Come later. Yeah, that's nice. I'm not gonna lie, the hot cocoa here is pretty freaking good. The first day we were down here, I got coffee. I wasn't a fan of the coffee, but this hot cocoa, I can't hear you. Well, I just knocked them over. This one's obviously way too big. I just spilled them, but look at how comfy these look. They do look comfy. Well, they got Mickey Mouse. Yeah. Mickey on the leg. Oh, they're lucky. They don't have my size. Sister. And then the matching hoodie to go with but it. I don't like that Mickey. I know that new style Mickey's kind of weird looking to me, but I guess you know. Mother times are changing. Now that we're leaving, they're getting all the Christmas stuff. Oh, that's cool. Countdown to Christmas? No, it's not. We're leaving. How much is it? It doesn't matter. We are leaving. We can't. Fifty-five dollars. Fifty-five dollars. That means that all the other folks will be getting all the Christmas stuff and First one's group number four, Katie. I mean, security was a breeze coming through. Uh, they got me for the nips, though. <laughs> I had five nips in my bag, and uh, you're only allowed beer and wine on your carry-on when you come in here, so sorry about that. <laughs> sorry, not sorry. <laughs> but now, we're finally doing it. Finally doing it, Harry. Go on the ship, see what happens. Excited? Yeah, I want to see those second side. What? What about the rest of the show?
Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. He's finally doing it. Thank you. Thank you. Wow. Disney Fantasy, please welcome aboard the LaForge family. Beautiful. Disney Fantasy, please welcome aboard the Hades family. We just checked in, did our little muster checkpoint. You had to take your cell phone out for your Disney Cruise app, and then you had to go to your assembly station and scan it with your phone. That's the new muster drill. So. We got that done and now we're going to Animator's Palette to lunch. have some lunch. I can't believe it. we're finally here. I mean, I've been talking about this for so long. It's my, my first cruise ever. And what better cruise to start off than on a Disney cruise? Look at these windows. You can see the port out there, Port Canaveral. Nice. So now from the main entrance, we're just heading down this hall to Animator's Palette for lunch? Sit down lunch? I love these butter knives, look like what you would use for painting. What is that? Cookies and cream cheesecake? It's not only cookies and cream, but it's also cheesecake. <laughs> <laughs> We're finally here. On board the Fantasy. In Animator's Palette. So, Katie, what'd you get? I got the beef empanadas. And it looks delicious. Are you ready? Good. That's some salsa. Good. Which I usually don't put on my empanadas, anyways. Very hot. Also, we have very hot. Very good. <laughs> and I got the seafood chicken gumbo with some cornbread. Pretty good. Not what I was expecting, but it's good. Is it something I would like? No. Are you saying that so I don't eat it? I don't think you'd like it. Why? I just don't think you would. What is this? Cornbread for ants? <laughs> How does the cornbread? Okay. How does it compare to the cornbread at Garden Grill? It doesn't compare. Garden Grill's cornbread was the best. Oh. We got the beef and the pasta because uh, I couldn't decide on what I wanted. So our wonderful server, Marcus, just brought out the pasta and we're gonna split it. What'd you get for dessert? I got the cookies and cream cheesecake. That looks delicious. Two of my favorite things, cookies and cream and cheesecake. And I got the welcome aboard Sunday. They both look wicked good. I am so looking forward to this because I love ice cream. Bomb.com. True golden girl. Love cake. Delicious. Once again, welcome aboard the beautiful Disney Fantasy. Welcome aboard. Just got done our welcome aboard lunch. And it was awesome. Oh my god, it was so good. I'm our, so full. Our servers were amazing, Marcos and Chip. Yes. Shout out to those guys. Uh, right now, we're gonna go down to deck one because Katie's got a headache and she needs some Tylenol or something for a headache. So you're gonna go down to deck one to the medical center. That's gonna have all your medication down there. Uh, free of charge. You don't have to pay for any, any of the medicine. 
Just gotta go down there and ask for Tylenol or whatever for your headache. There's Royal Court. That's my favorite. Hashtag the more you know. Also, shout out to Charlie. What was it? Garage Fish Keeper? Garage Fish Keeper TV, Charlie. I just met him. Awesome guy. Check out his channel. So we just went down to the health center and they hooked up Katie with some Tylenol and some Advil for a headache. And I just want to say thank you to everyone that works on that ship because uh, nobody was there at the moment she called and someone was there in like three seconds. It was incredible. So thank you. Also, while Katie's away, I have a surprise for her. I upgraded our room and she doesn't know. So she thinks we're staying in the belly of the ship but I actually got us a room with a balcony, a veranda family room, so can't wait to see the reaction on her face. What did you do? Surprise! Are you surprised? I am. We have a window. To the video that will also be playing on all screens throughout the vessel during the. A window. Look closer. Information will also be provided by the crew members who will be. Oh my goodness! You're crazy. Crew members in your area, should you have any additional questions. This is be any time beautiful. Your cruise, you require urgent medical attention. You should contact the medical center. <laughs> Better than being on the inside? I don't know. I don't know what the inside looks Look like. Look what else you got. What else do you got? If you require non-urgent medical assistance, you can call the we medical got center on phone or visit the ship's medical center. And we got lots and lots of beer. That's just an appetizer. The ship's forward guest the for adventure. What are you getting in that bag? I don't know. Ooh. Should you require non-urgent medical backpack? Oh, this backpack, backpack. Is there more stuff in there? Yeah. A towel. And a water bottle. Shape up or ship out. So cool. That's nice. That's a nice bag. That's cute. Holy Christmas. Six pack. Welcome aboard. That's your it's others. Water. Cruise. Oh, that's water. Yes. And my cruise line mug. It's a 21 ounce. But if you take it to the bar and get refills, they'll charge you for 16 ounces. But I think I'm going to be good for beer on this trip because <laughs> got a 24 pack coming later. Thank you for You like this room? Let's check this out. Let's check this out. We got some closets here. Ooh, life vest. Oh, like Marty McFly. Oh, if you want to use the uh, the lights in here, I need the key. I'll take my backpack off. So, if you come with a bunch of people up there, there's a bed, it pulls down from the roof. Bed pulled out of the couch here. Got a nice uh, king size bed. Katie's got her own veranda. So as soon as you first walk in on your right, you got a, a toilet room. Legit. Oh, just toilet? Right here. Really? Yeah, check it out. No, no kidding. Over here. We need this at the house. We have a, a separate room with the shower. Ooh. Or any showers. That's nice. Mm. 
Real nice H2O product, naturally. Gonna check the towels. Was it nice? They're not soft, soft, but they're nice. You like this room? I do. Think they notice if I stole this blanket? Yes. They would notice. <gasps> Look at subtle Disney. Look at in the comforter. Can you see it? Barely. Barely. It's Mickey. Let's check this out, bro. Decent space. Decent space out here. Whoop! Oh, almost fell. Ah, yeah. Be chilling. So we're on deck nine, midship. Probably the best spot on the whole ship, if you want my honest opinion. Looking out at Port Canaveral. Everyone's luggage still outside. That's where my luggage is. So much luggage. The Disney Cruise Line terminal right there. So I would say, mission accomplished, surprising, surprising Katie. How do you shut this door now? I guess. No, it is. Okay, that door's fun. When you hear this signal, so yeah, we got a decent sized room, nice chill room. We got a Frigidaire. We got a Frigidaire. Put our drinks in, mostly our waters, because we like cold water in this family. Also, my beer if I want to. For the briefing, you will not need to collect or wear your life jacket. However, it is critical that every member of your stateroom party remain quietly in so place pretty until awesome. the end of the briefing. Paying close a lot of room, a lot of storage. Got like a his and her side. Oh, hair dryer. So this is definitely her side. <laughs> a lot of room to store things. Oh, look, you got a little, uh, a little chair here. That's cool. And five. So me and my fat belly because we just had so much food and also these are not fruits they're rice krispie treats mickey shaped all different kinds like six different kinds so yeah that's our room well we're on our way Pulling away from the dock. You happy? I am. Let's see how you are after you've had your been on the water longer. Uh, yeah, we're not really too sure how I'm gonna be with seasickness yet, so this is probably the only time you're gonna see me my regular flesh tone. I might be green the rest of these vlogs. I'm sure the beer will help. I, I got a lot of beer. Has had a lot of beer. I've had a couple beers, but I also ordered a lot to the room. So hopefully that helps. Um, well, yeah, let's, uh, bye. Bye. I got the small one.
A little bit further, we're almost out of here. They're doing a tree lighting ceremony tonight. Night one, we just left Florida, 7.30 at night, and they're about to light up the Christmas tree. But we got here a little late, so I can't get a good spot. I'm sure all the vloggers out there have footage of the lighting of the Christmas tree. <laughs> but I just want to get up here so Katie could at least see it get lit up. Yep, starting right now. And then we're going out to eat after this. We're going to Animator's Palette again. But this time for the dinner menu. I'm gonna go because they're doing the ceremony now. And We got there, Katie. Nothing. Oh, that's pretty. Bad. No. What do you mean, not bad? <laughs> oh, that's nice. I like the colors. It is nice. I like the other one, though, a little better. What's the price on it? One fifty nine. One fifty nine. So that makes that one probably. I think I do have to do something to my Tyler. Disney Cruise Line golf balls. I don't know if it's worth it though, because Tyler always his balls always end up in the woods. <laughs> yeah. This is nice. Only one hundred thirty dollars. What? How much? One thirty. Is that it? That's yes. a steal. How much are lanyards? What? I didn't swear. That's it. Get me on a life raft. I'm out of here. $20. I'll carry it. <laughs> you gotta get one. $30. We still gotta get one. We should. As a part of the trip. We need it. What's this? Oh, postcards. Nobody uses postcards anymore. I don't even know where to buy a stamp. Just kidding, I do. That looks like that's for pins. Or a I pin think board. It's just a, um, yes. Board. Oh, yeah. Yeah, for pins. This is nice. Oh, that is nice. Look at the back. It is Fancy. nice, actually. Turn it around again. How much do they want for that? Is it a zip up? No. You know me, I hate zip ups. Yes. $60. On the nose. Really? $59.99. I, was, clo the I was close. Look at this. I can see you in this though. I like those shirts. I know. A li no, I'm not, I'm not kidding. I'm being serious. I could see you in that. That's it's nice. Cute. It says magic on it though. So? Is that me? Nothing. Oh. I wanted a fantasy one. Some fantasy socks? Yes. Put them on. I'll give you a fantasy. And that's going to cut out. <laughs> you can't steal it. Obviously, I can't even take one. I can't even buy it. Would you like some help? I didn't talk to you with kids. Oh, thank you. Thank you. That's pretty. We like them. Wow. But for the true test. <laughs> Can your phone fit? If it fits. Uh, mm, no. no. Dun, 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 dun. How much nope, is it? Not Just even. out of uh, curiosity. Out of curiosity, it is. 
$168. Alright, let's go. <laughs> so let's just get the bag instead. What is it? Oh, I like this. Reminds me of like Hulk Hogan's. That's cool. Letters. Why can't they just make it easy so you can see what the prices are? Oh, oh there they are. Seventy-nine ninety-nine. Wow, that's pretty. Oh, it's really long though. I like the little. I know. It looks like it was splattered I like the on. Gold. That is nice. Curiosity. Would you say he's matching leggings too? Leggings. Oh, that's nice. Real nice. So maybe it'll be a medium. We get the backpack, the hat. No, that's a little accessory. That's pretty. Definitely put that on the wish list. I am actually. Dear Santa. Dear Santa, aka Try to guess what the fish are are making, what shape the fish are making. I'm not gonna say anything. Everybody else, guess what they're making. Pretty. It's from the towel that was on the bed. What'd you think of dinner over at Animator's Palette? Um, I thought it was really good. I got the steak. I got the um, salmon tartare for my appetizer. It was 
good. It was different. It wasn't what I was expecting, but it was definitely good. I would actually get it again. And my dinner, the steak was good. The mashed potatoes were good. I didn't like the carrots or whatever the other white vegetable that was not cauliflower was. But other than that, it was good. Yeah, I liked it too. How'd you like your interaction with Crush? Um, that was adorable. Um, <coughs> I think, you know, having it that personal where literally you're talking to him, just like the, like in um, Epcot, it was nice. No, yeah, it was fun. It was a good time. I really enjoyed it. And I enjoyed my meal too, obviously. I'm a wicked foodie. Oh, I had? had the lemon chicken and I had the appetizer was that pasta. Yeah, it's kind of like a ravioli thing. Mm hmm. That was pretty good. And then cookies and cream sundae. Which we both had. And then they came out and sang happy anniversary to us because we're celebrating Christmas and our anniversary on this cruise. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, I liked it. I loved how the servers were. It was great tonight. Yep, Bennett and Harry, shout out to you guys. Yeah. Oscar came around. I think he was one of the managers. Mm -hmm. Checked on us right at the beginning, <laughs> right before we even got our entree, I think, while we were eating our appetizer. So, so far, night one, day one, the whole staff, everybody, are, they're awesome. 